video is actually dedicated to folks undergoing the 3MTT program. As a member of the 3MTT program, you should have your dashboard set up. Now, I will divide this video into three folds. One, I will show you how to assess your assignment. Two, I will talk about what you need to submit an assignment. And three, I will now show you how to submit the assignment. First thing is to go to your dashboard, which you can see my dashboard. Then go down to your courses. Under your courses, you see assessment. Now, like you can see here, I have assessment. Now I'll click on assessment. Now, after clicking on assessment, this is my week one assessment. To assess the assessment, the assignment itself, there's a link under where you have submitted. Now you can click on this link and to load. Now here you see everything you need for week one from the materials you need to study for week one and also to the assignment for week one. You might need to scroll down the page. I have scrolled down my page and here is my week one assignment. I'm with data science cohort. So my assignment is actually to write a Python script to calculate basic statistics. And for my own assignment, write a Python script. I'll need two things. I'll be using either the Jupyter up or i'll be using a visual studio code now i used the visual studio code to complete my own assignment but in case your assignment is not to write jupyter script you can also use whatever thing you need whether you need a microsoft word or you are using whatever platform you'll be writing your assignment i'll show you how to now submit that assignment now to submit your assignment the first thing you need is your google drive now this is my Google Drive. You need a Google Drive. Why? Because you'll be using the link on the Google Drive to submit your assignment. For your assignment, for my assignment, I used the Visual Studio Code. Here is the Visual Studio Code. All you need to do is create a file in your Visual Studio Code. When you finish with the file working on your assignment, you can now copy it and paste it in your Google Drive. Now you can pick the link from your Google Drive. But there's an easier way with the Google Drive itself. You don't really need to go through this route of creating a, of using Visual Studio Code. Let's go to Google Drive. Now, there is my Google Drive. In case you are doing, if your assignment is, take for example, those doing project management and other related courses that are not coding. If you are using Microsoft Word, instead of using Microsoft Word, you know you can use the Google Doc. Can use your google doc if your assignment has to do with an excel and you want to use google drive to submit your assignment you can easily use the google worksheet but for those that are coding instead of using google drive go to now go to new come to more then you can easily use the google google collaboratory now if you use the google collaboratory now google collaboratory will create the same thing you have in your jupyter lab so from here, you can easily run your codes. And when you run your code, you can now, after you finish running your code and running your assignment, you can now do a share screen, a share link. After you share your link, all you just need to do is come down here, any one with the link, now, I would, I would rather give a viewer of this file can see your comments and then you do done and you do your copy, your link. Now if I copy my link, I've copied the link here, do done, I've copied my link, then I can go to 3MTT. Now, to submit my assignment is very easy. Come to, you see, going to come back to assignments like we did in the first place. Go to, you see this link, submit your assignment. Since I've submitted my assignment, I think it's no longer like a lighting for me any longer. Just click on this submit assignment to give you a link. Now, through that link, you can now place the link you have copied from Google Doc on that link, on that space for the link. And that way you submit your assignment. It's not, it's not asking at all. I hope with this you understand how to submit your assignments. Thank you.